college, and that's what struck me because um, she knew everything about building a home. And um, I just thought that it's a crime that she was murdered, in my opinion, uh, Mother's Day of this year. And I also think it's a crime that her character is being assassinated this entire week. So I've taken off time to come up here and speak out on her behalf. Um, I ran a domestic violence shelter many years ago. It's classic. It's absolutely classic what we're hearing in there, that she had tried to break off the relationship and uh, her life was taken from her. But more importantly, I want the viewers to know that she was bright and she was intelligent and she was the top of her profession in my opinion. Um, I wanted to, we wanted to build another home with Benchmark having met Angel Downs and how articulate and intelligent that she was. When you say her character's being assassinated, or the, what do you mean specifically? What, what have you not liked that you've heard? Well, in my opinion, uh, her defense, his defense, Mr. Dodine's defense, have pretty much called her everything but the Antichrist, and um, I just think that's uh, heinous. I think it's heinous. I think it's an abominable. We need to let the jury hear all the evidence. I also think it's inappropriate the way some law enforcement on the stand have been treated. These are these gentlemen, in their professional opinion, stating what they saw at the scene of the crime. So for them to be uh, disrespected by the defense I think is completely inappropriate. Now you, uh, when, when I saw you outside at the beginning of the yes, morning, sir. I'd asked you if you would talk on television. You, yes, sir. you said no, you weren't interested in that. You sat in there, you heard some stuff, and now you are The reason I said that I didn't want to go visibly on TV is this man is prominent as having been a commissioner, and he's well connected. So I was a little concerned to speak out openly. However, justice is justice, and injustice is injustice. And a um, favorite quote of mine is from Dr. Martin Luther King. And he said that um, injustice anywhere in the world is a threat to justice everywhere in the world. And I firmly follow that conviction. And I want to see justice served. I want to see Angel Downs' murderer uh, put in jail. And I want the story of who this woman was and what a dear person she was. And maybe the family needs to not be able to talk so much. And maybe uh, District Attorney Newcomb, she's got her hands full and she's doing a great job. And maybe she can't speak out, but I sure can.